What's going on folks, Tough Country back at it again with another video. As you can see, we are back on the ice and we're doing some ice fishing. The main target species today is perch and pike. Big fish. Oh, that's a nice pike, Amanda. Got this nice little pike here. We're gonna go for that jellyfish bite as well. Awesome fish, great way to start the year. Did that go through in a one whack? Yeah, that's not safe ice. Alrighty, so we just got on the ice and we drilled a hole here and it's probably five to six inches. But as you can see, especially from the drone perspective, I saw all these lines on the ice. And this one right here, I just spud it up to that. And that's only, that, that might even be less than two inches. And it's all liquid. Like it's, it's almost like a slush. So we're definitely not going near that, but right here, totally safe. And we're just gonna have to fish within this radius pretty much probably. But let's get to drilling some holes, send some lines, send some tip ups, and hopefully the bite's on. First things first, gotta get our tip ups in. I got a quick strike rig uh, made with steel line here and I'm just gonna be putting a big dead sucker. This thing I picked up from Manatic Bait Shop and this should do the trick. I'm just gonna have it like that. I gotta cut the bladder out of it so that it doesn't float up when it's down there. But uh, I'm gonna show you guys something pretty interesting here in a second. It's something I made just the other day from the idea of a friend of mine. So there's the, there's the sucker and I'm just cleaning the belly, just like that. Not only will that get that air bladder down, but it also puts some fresh scent into the water, which will be good. So, so this is the first line, but take a look at this. This is a tip up lure designed by Luke from Limestone City Angler. This thing is awesome. I have not used it yet, but this is, this is my first outing this year. I just made it the other day, but essentially it's got a jig skirt at the top right there. And then it's got a bunch of beads, some blades, a weight that will hold your minnow down. And then I got another leader and to my quick strike rig with the minnow on it. But uh, essentially, I, I don't know how this will do for a dead minnow, but with a live minnow, it'd be swimming around and it would clank that together and create flash and vibration which will attract fish, but I, I assume it can only do good even for a dead minnow, but we'll try this out, see if the fish are biting, 
And if you want to learn how to make this lure, I'll put a link in the description to Luke's video. And this thing is really awesome, super cheap to make, and it should do the trick. I mean, I can't tell you firsthand if I've caught fish with it, but I'm going to get on it today and hopefully it does the trick. So let's get this line in, get to fishing. Alrighty, there's the first tip up set. Let's go get the other one going and hopefully the bite's gonna be on. I finally caught a fish, folks. I'm on them. I'm smashing them. Hey, Doyle. So here we go. Nothing crazy, but it's early ice. We're on uh, like four inches, maybe five. And we're getting fish. There we go. Woo! And check that out, folks, on a dinner bell. Micro Dinner Bell by Frostbite. It's a new color, it's like yellow with some red. It's getting it done. Oh yeah, there we go. Just hammering it, man. Dude, the whole bottom of the graph is just fish. It's just fish, folks. There we go. They're so freaking aggressive, man. Dude, I can't believe how aggressive they are. It's like freaking, they're shooting up like six feet for a naked frostbite dinner bell. Well, it has been a crazy evening to say the least. We've only been here for an hour and a half to two hours and it has been non-stop yellow perch action. We haven't got the pike, we haven't got the walleye, but it's been a fun time catching perch. We probably caught a hundred between the three of us. Just crazy. But we're gonna keep fishing till dark. We got probably an hour left, maybe the last half hour. But uh, I just wanted to say my outro now, just in case it gets too dark. So if you enjoyed this video, make sure to hit that like button. If you got any questions or concerns, leave a comment below because we love hearing from you guys. If you didn't subscribe to the channel, make sure to subscribe because we're dropping videos every Sunday. Thank you all for watching and we'll catch you in the next one.